But now at five, a second child has died after last night's crash on Sandbridge Road in Virginia Beach. I'm Tom Shad. And I'm Nicole Livis. We just got the names of the victims, 14-year-old Cheyenne Gurney and 10-year-old Cherish Gurney. The crash also sent others to the hospital. We brought you the breaking news last night on Wavy News 10 on Fox 43. Sandbridge Road was closed for hours. 10 year side's Erin Kelly has been following the new developments all day long. She's live now at Centera Norfolk General Hospital where some victims are still recovering. Erin, you talked to a neighbor at four and now you've talked to people who think the road needs to be safer. Yeah, we talked to people who live in that area. They say that they weren't surprised when they heard that there was a crash last night. They're sorry to hear that this was a deadly accident, but they tell us that that road is just too dangerous. It's a pretty tight knit community in Sandbridge and, and everyone's just making sure you're, everyone's OK. Family, friends, texting, talking. They're talking about this deadly crash on Sandbridge Road. Police say it happened Wednesday night around 7 o'clock. Sean Devine saw the first responders from his home down the road. Just for 20 minutes straight, it was nothing but fire trucks and ambulance and EMS and police. Police say a sedan with seven people inside went off the road. And when the driver overcorrected, a pickup truck heading the other way crashed into the side of the car. It threw one person from the car. It's just awful. I. It's. It's uh, pretty upsetting that, I mean, for anybody to get hurt, but especially kids, and it, and it sounds like it, they could have just been here on spring break or having, enjoying themselves. Police say two children died. Four kids and one adult were still in critical condition Thursday. We have a really heavy heart about it. It all happened just down the road from where Katie Keene works. She says it's a dangerous stretch of road. It's hard to kind of comprehend why nothing's being changed in this area, and uh, only hope that they can fix it in the near future. And police tell us the pickup driver suffered minor injuries. The passenger in that pickup was in stable condition. Again, the victims, 14-year-old Cheyenne Gurney, 10-year-old Cherish Gurney. Now, I just got off the phone with the public works director for Virginia Beach. He tells me they have made some improvements on the road in that area, softening some of the curds, but they are limited as to what they can do because of the wetlands in that area. They say the long-term plan is for the extension of Nemo Parkway, but again, that's a long-range plan that requires more funding. Live in Norfolk tonight, Aaron Kelly, 10 on your side.